Hey howdy hey, welcome to Ask Erin, where I, Erinman43, will be answering your questions. First off, we have five questions from Harry Humble Q1. Would you put Saturday Supercade, Rubik's The Amazing Cube, and Pac-Man The Hanna-Barbera series to Classic Kids Channel 1 or 2? That's always Classic Kids Channel 2, I suppose, that is protected by um, Hanna-Barbera shows, including The Smurfs. Pac-Man and any other accessories, especially the Jetsons. Maybe the Flintstones will be there as well. Q2. What is your favourite game besides Mario? Well, my favourite game besides Mario are Pac-Man, Phoenix, Space Invaders and Tetris. Well, I got the, I got the magical Tetris challenge on the Nintendo 64. If you haven't checked it out, check out to my tour of our house on my YouTube channel if you can as well. Q3. What PS1 games do you own? Well, that's a good question. I own What Grants the Search of Rep for Reptar, ISS Pro Evolution 2, Demo 1, which is the first one, um, Shrek's Amazing Adventures or Treasure Hunt or anything. And also Pac-Land, which is based on Pac-Man. And of course, Disney's interactive Hercules, The Greatest Adventure, I think. Q4, Wolfwalker Beyond, Beyond TV Burp. Well, let's just think. I might include them, Frogger Beyond. We'll wait and see. And Q5. Have you watched my old videos? I've watched the rant of Pac-Man Goes the Adventures and I heard that you're not very interested on Pac-Man and Goes the Adventures. You're more interested on the original Pac-Man. Miss Pac-Man does not exist in Pac-Man and Goes the Adventures. I think he... I think he is. Of course. I have watched some episodes on Disney XD but... I don't think I don't think that airs no more. I don't think. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good one. Shiny Knight ask, can you make a pretend TV guide for one of your channels and show it to us? Mayday fifty one or some showed me a um, classic kiss channel schedule, so I'm not sure about that, but I don't feel like making any TV guides and things like that because I couldn't be bothered to do anything else, so I may as well just make continuity videos and things like that. Neo's Reviews asked, Can we watch Classic Kids Channel? I know what you're thinking about Classic Kids Channel actually airs on TV, but I wish it, I wish if that if it, I wish if that would be a proper TV channel, then so people can watch this. So, um, maybe, um, if the channel will become more popular, it will be a pro proper TV channel. I had a little chat with AJ the Snake YT, and, um, basically, she, sa she says that if the channels become popular, you might become a proper YouTube channel, and, um, she says something about replacing CBeebies and things like that. So, um, yeah, I think so as well. <laughs> I like your um, Cartoon Network 2 um, items. That reminds me of 2006 ones. I, yeah, I haven't accessed to um, the Boomerang items from 2007 or 2008. For example, War Underwater ones and the Dragon ones with the bicycle theme from 2008, etc. Next up, we have two questions from my na na noddy mate. Joseph Fisted, Q1. Are you going to put any more Hanna Barbera shows on Classic Kids Channel like Adam's Family, 70s and 90s cartoons, and the Jetsons? I th I think about the Jet the Jetsons on Classic Kids Channel too, and um, I'm not sure about Adam's Family because um, I haven't watched that yet, but so I'm not quite sure. But I did watch um, the Scooby Doo show and the new Scooby Doo Mysteries. That's on Classic. That's on Classic History Channel Two until it got replaced by Transformers Prime. Yes. Q two. Can you put Bob's Burgers on Superstar Comedy? Bob's Burgers. Pfft. 
Why would I ever put Bob's Burgers on Superstar Comedy when Bob's Burger shows are rubbish? The Bob, Bob's Burgers shows um, are, are protected by Simpsons, the great se the, cent the Century Fox logo. 20th Century Fox? Yes, of course. Basically, it basically if it will become popular, if we have Bob's Burgers in real life and things like that. Pfft, I doubt that. I watched The Simpsons. I have watched them um, Future on and things like that. So yeah. Next up, we have six questions from a YouTuber who first asked me any questions for the very first time. He is the one and only Spascot Walk Talkman the Super VHS Advert Boy. Rock on, man. Q1. Have you got any Bob the Builder video cassettes? If so, can you upload the starts and closing on Bob the Builder videos cassettes? I have, um, I used to have um, Pilcher Steal the Show and um, Naughty's Bud down there, but I can't be bothered to upload the starts and ending bits because I'm worried that um, he might get copyright issues from, from the Hit Entertainment who might get blocked in Germany, so yeah. I doubt that. Q2. Do you like the Hit Video logo and the Hit Entertainment logo? Well, yes, I like the very first one with the star on it. And uh, I like the one with the little globe thing. The, the second one, the Hit Entertainment, the globe thing with the little things around the world. I like both of them. But I don't like the cube-shaped Hit Entertainment thing. No, that would be even more rubbish. -er. Q3, have you seen a Bob the Builder website promo? Yes, I have seen a Bob the Builder website promo. Um, at the beginning, that Bob the Builder was surfing, was practicing doing some surfing because he thought that Randy says he was going surfing today. Bob, I meant surfing on the internet! Exactly, that's right, Wendy. He, she does mean um, serving on the internet. She created her own Bob the Builder website now. <laughs> yeah, I think so. If you want to, go online to www.bobthebuilder.com. And um, I think it's on Web for Hive or things like that. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Anyways. Q4. Do you like the tweeties? If so, who is your favourite character? A lot of peeps think they like Milo because he's a because he has a Fabaroonie voice. But I prefer Max because he because he does documentaries about different stuff like come outside. Q five. Have you seen Bob the Builder Can We Fix It? Album promo from Scarecrow Dizzy VHS. Well, I have seen it on I've seen it on YouTube if some people were Uploading any stuff and opens and closes and anything like that. Yeah, I have seen it and it reminds me of that song, of course. Especially my favourite song. My two favourite songs, actually. Can We Fix It and Mambo Number 5. And of course, S Super Spud. Spud's on the job! I'm Super Spud. You can't scare there. I'm a scarecrow I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And Q6, what is your favourite Tweenies episodes? Well, a lot of peeps think they like um, sleepovers because Marlo's getting into out a lot of trouble. But I like Clock Shock! Boom! Yes! Clock Shock, yes. Um, yeah, Clock Shock is the best one because I like the I like the one when, when they have, when the Tweenie clock has goes so fast and it exploded. That's why Max has to get the toolbox to fix it. Oh dear, I think that's about it. So I'll be dozing off and I'll hopefully see you guys again next week. Cheerio! Well, thank, you. thank you very much.